everybody, welcome to the first race of NASCAR Next Series. This is the Daytona 200 at Daytona National Speedway, Daytona Beach, Florida. And, uh, as you can see, I have made this track for wood. I made it with paint, too. Except for the grass, that I actually have markers. And it's, it's somehow... I try my best to do it, but uh, yeah, I don't have real green paint, so I decided to smash all these green colors of crayons, I mean markers, and fill it all over the goddamn, you know. So, uh, yeah. <coughs> As you can see here, I made paper cars, and I don't know why I should have explained myself to create paper cars, because you're not, you guys are not into it that much, so, I just do it for videos, that's all I gotta say for it, except, except for this one, this is not actually a paper, it's custom, I, I painted it, and I made a custom, Car of Ty Majowski 64 for 2018. Also, Cedric and Chase Briscoe has won it in the Xfinity series. But this is Ty Majowski right now. So, yeah. As you didn't know, you guys didn't know that you are new and uh, watching this, I made paper cars for three years ago. Insanely, three years ago. And over here, I made custom cars a lot, especially for the ones that I bought, and actually not custom, but yeah, even for Xfinity cars too. But you know, let's move on to this. We have Ty Majowski in the 60, as I already showed you already. Todd Gillen in the 60. Penetry, the truck paint scheme that is actually a can pro series driver, but a truck driver in part time. But he's planning to move full time for this year. And number four, when Christopher Bell left for the Sweet Series. While he helps in the 18, now said you drink, although that looked like Cal Brush's Xfinity paint scheme, but this is why he helps driving it right now. Katie Lampage, if I say his uh, last name, but well, he's a NASCAR Pinty Series driver, he's driving a Dodge Challenger. Haley Deegan, actually not an Oscar driver, but he, she, it's a female, but she is a normal truck driver, and I don't know, I'm not into normal truck racing, all I am to is NASCAR, so, what she's planning to do, actually, to become a NASCAR driver, is drive a M19 can of proceeds car for this year. Same Smith for the number 55, Jello. No, uh, Exxon sponsor available. 51 of Harrison Burton truck car text imaging in which he ran part time in this truck, but also ran full time in Canada Pro Series in 12. Chase Brady in 17, although that didn't look like a actual Chase Brady's paint scheme, in which is a Shell Lake 17 car that I made three years ago, but. This is Chase Pretty right now. I bet I can make a normal Chase Pretty paint scheme that has a Toyota on it. Silly enough. Or an Alka car in a. I don't know. But. Maybe I was planning to uh, change the uh, numbers and drivers on that. That's what I gotta do. And finally, number four of Chase Pretty. Another can of Pro Series driver. He drives a Toyota. So let's get this going here. Oh jeez. Although there are no walls here, so I have to be careful for these cars hold up before they fall off. So this is my issue for that. But you know, let's just start this race as we're going already. Tamajoski, the leader, already got a good start. Free wide in the start already with Wally Herbs, Kitten, Land Patch, and Todd Gillan. Although, this one count 
if they fall off to the ground because I have no wall so don't kill that L that L wreck <laughs> I can't speak language god damn it English language still can't alright lap 2 somehow done that side by side we'll only look forward to like Catch up with Tyler Joski. I can only see my camera. I don't know what for sure, but I always do it. I almost looked like four wide, but nah. Don't count that out. We didn't always have four wide on Daytona, so now nah, it won't count. But at least three wide counts. Good to know that. Looks like Saint Smith is side by side with Tamajowski as he wants to steal his win. But Tamajowski still pulls away the lead. The other the other car, the truck driver, Haley Deegan, is trying to catch up to his lead. So she wants his first win in a taller, but she, she must have to pass Tamachowski first. Lap three. Lap drivers packed up. The oh, shoot. I, like I said, I always look at the camera, but the camera is too big for my tablet, so, shit. Oh. Well, I will count that as a side-by-side -side lead. Here with Deacon, looks like she ready to get the one. Even say Swift, as he was not giving up yet. Now Haley Deegan is leading. She is having her chance to win her first race at Daytona. Her start of a Daytona 200. Lap 4. I forgot to mention that this is only going to have 5 laps. So, yeah. Only 5 laps that will count on every track. If the tracks are small, then I'll count that as 10 laps. That is part of a rule for the whole series. And that's how it gonna goes. So, I know this seems kind of lame to you because I made cars out of paper, which is uh, lame. But you know, I did have much NASCAR diecast. So, I'm not a collector yet. But I shall continue for this. Yeah. Yeah, we did get a story. My finger hurts right now. I should have used my phone, but my phone always has storage. Out of storage. So, what that means is I can no longer record any videos when I have too many photos and too many downloads on every gallery of my app. By the way, take Todd Gillan has passed Haley Deegan, even Harrison Burton in the second place. So, might be Todd Gillan's chance to win it. Or Tyler Joski. Where have we seen him before? Well, he looks like he's back in the lead, but this is going to be a final lap. Could Todd Gillan pass back through Tyler Joski to win his first race? Or Tom Chowski. If he would stay in the lead, that would be fine. Yeah, shoot. I'm shaking all over the place. It's probably my fingers. My fingers are crapping. They might break soon, but hopefully not. Tom Chowski back in the lead.
Here's a burden side by side with Tabachowski while Todd Gillen is behind him. Might be a chance to Tabachowski for his first race. Who could stop him? Todd Gillen crosses the finish line. Harrison Burton and Ty Majowski are too late to pass them. Will this piece fall out? In which it won't be stay there in a while, but you know who cares? Let's see. Anyways, Ty Todd Gillen has won his first race at the Daytona 200. 